time for my turn to be part of Ice Shaker. It's just been growing, 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 and growing, just like these muscles right now. Hold up. Oh. Jug. <laughs> the gallon Is jug this big enough Ice for you? Shaker, yes. I'm Chris Gronkowski, founder and CEO of Ice Shaker. What's up, everyone? We're here at the gym where the Gronk Bros work out. I finally realized that running a business is more like being a head coach. Hold on. Cheating. Yeah, right there. Shark Tank did what everyone says it does. I was exploded that day. They really exploded for the whole week. What people don't see is the sharks don't come in and just do all the work for you. What's up, everyone? I'm Chris Gronkowski, founder and CEO of Ice Shaker, and this is my hustle. So this is the story of Ice Shaker. I'm here in Dallas, it's super hot out. I'm going to the gym, I'm leaving work. I'm going to grab a different plastic bottle at home. And by the time I get there, it's sweating. I'm actually making little sweat rings on the ground in the gym. And I take a sip of it, it's warm. It tastes kind of kind of weird from my last drink I had in there. It just kind of hit me then. It's like, why isn't there something better out there? There's nothing that could actually blend and shake powder. I started on the mission to make the best bottle that I could really for myself. I called it Ice Shaker because we had this uh, idea that you, know, you just put ice in it and you shake it and that would kind of like break up the powders, which definitely wasn't a great way to do it. We fixed that, we added an agitator and that's why it was called the Ice Shaker. When I started Ice Shaker, my wife and I already had a business tool. We already had some connections. We used those connections then to get prototypes made. About 20 prototypes later, we ordered a bunch. The first shipment I got was 10,000 bottles. The guy ended up showing up at like 6 p.m. on a Friday. Yo, this is with no dock doors. This is taking it off, putting it into the street of my house. A 60 pound boxes, uh, you know, divide that by 10,000. That's how many boxes we had to carry up like my little narrow stairway of my house. And uh, it was still one of the hardest shipments and like workouts I've ever had. So three months in, I remembered that I had this email from almost five years previous and said, hey, ABC Shark Tank's looking for any current or former NFL players to come on the show. In my mind, I'm like, one day I'm gonna come back to this email and I'm gonna have something awesome. So uh, fast forward, it was four and a half years later, I did a video submission. And at that point they said, hey, we'd love to continue to move you on to the next stages. For us, we had offers from all five sharks. So it was this huge proof of concept and sales exploded. Sales exploded that day. They really exploded for the whole week. They wanted me call it, to call it the Gronk Shaker. They thought it was a huge mistake. And Mr. Wonderful at one point said, how much inventory do you have in stock? Can we melt them all down and change the name? I thought it was a huge mistake. To me, putting the name on it would limit the market. There's a lot of people out there that hate the New England Patriots. So to do that really limited you to a niche that I, I thought was a disadvantage for the products. So we did come in with a limited edition Gronk Shaker. Uh, they did well. I don't think they did as well as everyone thought they would do. Just kind of showed that it wasn't the, the right play. You don't, you don't have to lift it up like that. Just sip out of it. Yeah, you don't, no, you don't need to pick it up. You can just sip it like that. You don't have to lean it up because it got the straw. There you go. <laughs> there we go. I'm learning every day. What's cool about the bottle is uh, first off the handle. So super easy to hold handle. It's gonna snap down, so when you're shaking it, it's not flying around. Easy open pop top, chug it, easy to close it. Twist off the top, you're gonna to see right away. Uh, it's that kitchen grade stainless steel, measurement markings inside. It is insulated, so it will keep your drink cold for 30 plus hours. Uh, it's also not gonna sweat. Uh, right away, you'll see this, which is a twist and agitator. The main purpose of this is to actually break up powders. No one likes to drink a chunky protein shake, uh, so that's gonna stop that from happening. It does a great job of blending. Uh, but it also works as a strainer, so this will always allow for a good pour, which then makes it like the ultimate martini shaker as well. Our personalization aspect of the company is also a huge separator for us. Uh, we turn items in three to five business days. Most people can't turn items in a month. So here's how the lasers work. We bring the logo in, we 3D the logo. So you can see the shape of the bottle, you can see the shape of the logo. The laser's gonna hit on all sides of it, which is uh, pretty, pretty fun to watch. But well, we're ready to go. Are you ready for this? We go. Oh. You know, this was a business that was being run out of the upstairs of my house, uh, no employees, and all of a sudden, sales just started pouring in. You know, the customer service, the, the shipping, everything you could possibly think of in a small business was just put on me. Just really, really long hours. All right, let me show you how it's done. Here we go, order going out. All right, you guys timing me? Here we go. Record speed right there. Even though the company was successful, Shark Tank crushed it, all that, 
it takes a lot of cash to grow. I lived off the, the wifey salary for, for two and a half years and got to hear all about it, but at the end of the day, you know, we went from one bottle, one size, one color, uh, to over about 60 SKUs that following year. Guess what's behind that door? That's when it went from the side hustle to the full-time business. At that point, it was like, hey, let's get a warehouse. Let's figure this out. Let's get some employees. Let's really get this thing cranking because it, it's, it's going now. Our first warehouse that we're gonna stop by a little bit later here, 3,000 square feet, no air conditioning. We're basically living in a sauna for eight hours a day. We were all really shredded though. This was the first guy that was actually willing to go into that first warehouse that we had that I was talking about before where it was probably 120 degrees every day. But you know what? I was shredded. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I finally realized that running a business is more like being a head coach for years and, and I think it actually stopped us from growing faster. I was trying to be way more than the coach. You know, I was trying to be the player, the coach, the assistant, pretty much pretty much every spot. Yeah, so when Rob comes here, uh, we tried to get him to work in the warehouse. He actually got fired, throwing passes in the back to Josh. He dropped a pass and he ruined a bottle. At that point we had to fire him, so. Yeah. That was about a year ago. A year later, came back. He was engraving yesterday. He's also able to grab the tall boxes on the second rack because Josh can't reach them. So, so when so. they get a lot of orders and they gotta, you know, get to the bottles up top because they're selling so many down here. I just go like that. Here you go, Josh. Thanks, Rob. Not a problem. Have a great day, Josh. All right, let me introduce you to our marketing master. We got Rhino over here. Come on, let's say what's up to Ryan. So my name is Ryan Walt, Chief Marketing Officer for Ice Shaker. I met Chris years ago. We went to undergrad together at the uh, University of Arizona. When he was just starting Ice Shaker, he invited me to come on board and, and head up the marketing. Still got it. Let's go to the gym, my brothers are waiting. Oh, and I might show you that original warehouse. Let's go. Never seen before, the gold edition. At some point, we're gonna break this out. I don't know when yet. I leave it in my truck. I remind myself every day we're gonna do something awesome with that bottle. Do you have some ideas for it? Comment below, let us know what we should do with the golden ticket bottle. So actually, we're passing right now. This was our second warehouse right here. Uh, we went from 3,000 square feet to a 6,000 square foot warehouse. We just left our, our current one, which is about 16,000 square feet. So we're going to our, our first warehouse. We actually made a great relationship with the gym. We're here now. You don't even know it's a gym. It looks like a warehouse. What's up, everyone? We're here at the gym where the Gronk Bros work out. But we're here with the owner, Chris Brainyard. Chris, say what's up. What's up, everybody? We're gonna try out his brand new pre-workout and show you how the ice shaker works in action. So let's do this. We're gonna taste test it right now. There you go, there we go. Agitator on. Twist it on. Make sure you close the pop top. Pop top closed, shake it up. You know what it tastes like? The red part of a bomb pop. I'm going 9.25 on this first flavor, man. What's your rating? 9.6 out of 10. The ice shaker bumps it up to a 9.7. Now it's kicking in, so now it's at a 9.9. .9. And it will stay at a 9.9 .9 depending on how the workout goes. You ready for this workout, bro? Yeah. Tight. That's tight what though. the ice shaker does. We work out. Man, I'm already out of water and we haven't even started yet. The oh. jug. <laughs> the oh. gallon jug. The gallon is jug big ice you. shaker. Thank you, thank you. I've been waiting for this Did it take one. long enough? Yeah, it's okay, <laughs> you know. If you're patient and you wait, it's well worth the wait then. I agree. It's just unbelievable to see the company grow. Well, now I wanted to be a part of it and I was like, wait, bro, how can I be a part of it? He's like, he's like, how about you buy out A-Rod? So I hit up A-Rod. I was like, it's time for my turn to be part of Ice Shaker. I bought him out. And uh, just from there, the last couple years, it's just been growing, 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 and growing, just like these muscles right now. Hold up. I mean, I bring my ice shaker everywhere. It's just great to have that size now. I'm pumped yeah. about it. Be ready for the grind. Start what you love doing, chip away at it, and then once you find the actual route, once you get that proof of concept, once you know it's gonna be successful, then go all in on it. Shout out to everyone. Thank you for watching My Hustle. Hope we inspired you today to put that work in yourself, start your own business, follow your dreams, chase your passions, and do it big. Gronkowski Bros are out. Boom.